side. This is the 104th season of George Washington basketball. George Washington against Howard. Utah Watanabe jumping center against Marcus Hall. And we're underway. The Colonials win the tap. The season ready to go and rolling here in Foggy Bottom. But the shot clock is not working, so they stop the game at 17. Checked at 19.53, so we're underway, but unable to get anything going. The shot clock did not start. Obviously, the crew here on the scorer's table, it's their first game of the new campaign as well. So now they're going to test it to see if it works. It got down to 27. They want to go to 23 because it says 19.53, but it... It really shouldn't be 23 because the Colonials didn't get the tap until a couple of seconds went off the clock. But anyway, that's nitpicking here. It'll be GW Basketball. On the first possession, Terry Nolan Jr. will inbound. Gets it over to Jair Bolden. Run away. Bolden works his way left side for Terry Nolan Jr. Down in the corner, it is Arnoldo Tor Toro. Fires a long three-pointer. It's no good. Got his own rebound. Out to Utah. Terry Nolan on the left wing. Hands the ball off to Jair Bolden. Bolden between the circles, right side for Nolan. Toro at the free throw line. It is a zone 1-3-1 one, one by Howard. Long jumper by Bolden, no good. Steves fights for the rebound. It's a foul inside against Howard. And the personal will go against Jalen Jones, his first and the team's first. It's already a couple of offensive rebounds for the Colonials. 0 for 2 from the field, but their possession continues here in the first minute of the game. Baseline underneath it'll be Patrick Steves. Gets it out to Toro. Now to Terry Nolan. He's on the left wing. The entry down low to Toro, and looked like he might have walked. He did. Shuffled his feet in the paint, trying to figure out what he wanted to do, and it's a turnover to Howard. Nice crowd here at the Smith Center on the season opener night. A little bit later start because the women's volleyball team took on Dayton earlier. Dayton won that match. And a jumper from the outside by Charles Williams is no good. But down low, we've got another foul against Howard, and it's against Jalen Jones. He's going to have to come out of this game quickly. That's his second personal in a matter of 50 seconds, and he'll be replaced by Zion Cousins, a 6'7 freshman from Upper Marble, Maryland, at Frederick Douglass High School. A lot of local flavor from both of these clubs. And a nice crowd here representing both schools here in Foggy Bottom to start this game. Yuta Watanabe on the left side, and Nolan thinks about firing up a long three, feeds it low, blocks the Steves. Back to the basket, drive balls knocked out of bounds by Hall as he tried a cross pass for a cutting Nolan, which would have been a nice layup, but a good defensive play by Hall. Shot clock says 13, right baseline inbound for Jair Bolin. Out to Terry Nolan Jr. Up top, it's Arnold Toto. Right side, it's Steves. Steves over Watanabe, dials a three, air ball. And the rebound saved out of bounds by Delik Mingo. Gets it over to R.J. Cole, and here comes Howard. Cole, wide open, 16-footer. Left-hander, no good. Rebound taken down by Yuta. Yuta into the front court, top of the key. Left side, Nolan. Gets it off to the wing for Jair Bolden. In the corner, Nolan's wide open, three-pointer left baseline. Good! Terry Nolan Jr. A three-pointer to start his college career. And GW is up 3-0. R.J. Cole right side up top for Cousins. Between the circles, man-to-man -man by GW. There is a long jumper by Charles Williams. It's no good. Ball bounced out to Jair Bolden. Two on two. Pull-up three-pointer left side. Short. Rebound Marcus Hall for Howard. The outlet up the left side, R.J. Cole. Stops, feeds it to Hall. Hall gets it down low, picks it up. Ball knocked out of the way back outside for R.J. Cole. Set it up for Howard. 15 shot clock for the Bison. Cole, stutter step against Bolden. Three-pointer is around no good. Rebound Yuta. Watanabe brings the ball up. Arnaldo Toro heads off for Jair Bolden. Bolden left side, Terry Nolan Jr. Gets it up top to Jair between the circles. Backs it out over to Nolan. Nolan looking down low up to Jair. Jair shakes and bakes over to Nolan. And the A three-pointer left side too hard. We've been tapped around underneath. Toro's got it. Falls down. Loses his balance. Steal for Howard Bison. Taken away by Zion Cousins. Driving all the way through. And a jam from Charles Williams. 3-2 to two, GW. 
Williams had 27 last year here at Smith Center and showing his athletic ability there with a two-handed dunk. Three minutes in here, first half. Nolan gets it to the free throw line for Steves. The 15-footer is good. And it's 5-2, to two, George Washington. So Patrick Steves is on the board. Driving his Cole down the lane. The floater with his offhand is good. R.J. Cole's a lefty, but a beautiful right-handed teardrop. 5-4, to four, GW. Jair Bolden into the front court between the legs dribble. Guarded by Delik Mingo on that part of the zone. It's a 2-3. The intermute is knocked away. Taken back by Steves. Kicks it outside for Bolden. Bolden will drive left side. Up top to Steves. Pump fakes. Drives down the lane. No look pass. He's stolen away. Too much passing there. R.J. Cole gets it up. And the drive by Delik Mingo is blocked away. Recovered by Marcus Hall. Three-pointer top of the key by Williams is good. And he's got the hot hand early for Howard. 7-5. to five. Bison have the lead. They're first of the game. Terry Nolan Jr. gets it back to Jair Bolden. Bolden goes the left side for Nolan. The entry to Steve's down to Arnaldo Toro. The lay is good. And what? Beautiful pass from Steve's to Toro and the game tied at seven. Great interior passing early on by the